Yes, welcome back, my sons. I've returned. I was busy running some IRL combat missions, but now that we're back, it's time to uh, get back into it, play some battle tech. And uh, we're playing modded. Got yet another mech lab loaded in here, a few other mods. Not necessarily to make the game easier, but uh, in some cases more difficult, but certainly more dynamic. It'll be fun. Uh, one of the mechs I'm running in this is a Wolverine that has two melee weapons, one in each hand, two axes. We're calling it the Berserker. And it has uh, a counterpart, other another Wolverine, much like it, that has uh, equipped with a supercharger. And we're punching up. We're like a level 90 mission, and we're just running medium and two mediums and one heavy. Two heavies, two mediums. And we're just going to be brawling. I don't even know what's going on here. We're going to find out. Look at that. Double axe. Oh, we swinging. Oh, yeah. This, this guy, we stacked a supercharger and a mask. So he's, uh, he's going like 170 kph, just flying out of the gate. We've got the Agincourt Archer with nothing but SRMs and a couple lasers, and then we got the other Wolverine with some claw and knuckles, but uh, a little more speed and armor. So uh, pretty balanced, but we're also going up a little higher than we should be. Oh, see? Oh, geez, there's an Atlas. This might not work out, folks. But who are we kidding? This is Warlord Tarzan. We don't mess around. Oh, jeez. Death from above! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Die! Right in the face, dude. That was awesome. <laughs> Get on my level. Get out of here. Oh, my gosh. Another Highlander. Oh, he's got a sword. Don't mess with this guy. He's got a sword. Sir, put the sword down. Oh, jeez. He almost cut my leg off. Oh, there's an atlas. Okay. Uh, we might have effed up. But who are we kidding? Not screw around here. Give me that. I'm taking that arm off. There we go. Yeah, send them all to hell. Actually, yeah, let's get this Atlas first. He's got a million SRMs, and I don't like him. Let's see if we get a headshot with this hatchet. If I could see what I was doing. Oh, right in the face. Yeah, you don't like that, do you? Yeah, get out of here. Oh, get eviscerated, bro. <laughs> we got the War FX. Uh, ooh, a War FX mod, which makes all these uh, really cool effects, as you can see. Oh, get chopped to death. Yes! Yes, for the Emperor. Glorious melee combat. The hands, the hands were not meant to shoot, but to beat. Skulls. Yes. I think you're doing. Get out of here. Yes. Ooh, 25. Okay, we got a few. You get out of here. Got a couple pulse lasers, you know. Just in case. Just in case. Whew, that was a brawl. That was a brawl and a half. <laughs> like four assault mechs. Almost got my leg chopped off by that Atlas. Or that uh, Highlander. Kind of seems weird to have a Highlander with a katana, though, if you think about it. Just kidding. There can only be one. Alright. We're going to go use a repair bay over here, because... We were doing a multi-mission, and wow, I'm surprised that the rest of my the rest of my boys didn't get totally annihilated there. 
I must have taken most of the hits. So we got a multi-mission, and so even uh, randomly some missions will spawn repair bays. That's one of the mods I installed. So that helps a little bit with these multi-missions. But uh, yeah, we've got Azincourt. We installed with a supercharger. Because running as fast as you can with short-range missiles is a lot of fun. Just like watch how many missiles fly out of this. I saved this loadout. That's another mod we put in here. Or as part of yet another, yet another mech lab, you can save your loadouts. But if I wanted to like say, I don't know, shoot all my missiles right here, just be like, see you later everything. <laughs> Absolute missile boat. Oh, there's some tanks? Unacceptable. Nothing can live in the desert. This is my desert. Alright, anybody else? Anybody else want to F around? That's what I thought. Oh, we got a contender. Ladies and gentlemen, the contender. Let's see how many missiles it will take to get to the center of this Centurion. It's time to rock and roll. All right, I'm going to breach this wall right here. Or not. Maybe that one. There we go. Just overheat in the process. <laughs> see you later. Mm, stomp all over this stuff so you can see some of the cool effects. Smoke comes out of everything now. Pairs your visibility, which is kind of fun. Makes it a little more exciting. Oh, all more tanks. All right, all right. I think you get the point. Anyway, we're back in business. We're going to be playing a few more of these. I may start the series over a little bit later in the in the uh, career. Uh, I think I set this one on like 3015. I'm just playing playing through it last couple days, but I'll probably start over. We'll go a little bit closer to the clan era, maybe like 3035 or something, and start from there and work our way up to the uh, arrival of the clans. And that will be super cool. Uh, we'll see how that goes. We'll add some more mission types, do some other stuff, but yeah, that's where we're on the horizon. And then uh, I will be also playing um, a new game in November that has to do with Warhammer 40k, so that'll be exciting. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. Uh, hope you enjoyed that. There's going to be lots more to come, so stay tuned or I'll kill you.